In this video, we are gonna go over how to set up an actual video campaign using the new AdWords platform. Okay, this is all about video, video in-stream, pre-roll, and display ads. So let's jump in. First thing you'll notice that I have up on the screen is the actual platform. Okay, it is the new platform. And with that, there have been some growing pains, but it is getting better. So the very first thing you're gonna wanna do is jump over here to a campaign. Okay, hit the plus button. And we're gonna do a video campaign, and this video is gonna be for product and brand consideration. Okay, you can choose if you're doing shopping, you can choose the drive views engagement. I mean, these are all options. It doesn't really matter. I think it's more for tracking purposes so Google can see what people are trying to do. So I'm gonna put marketing high demo. And I'll show, I'll, I'll show you the video in a second that I'm gonna market and why this video seems to work. Okay, we're gonna go $20 a day. You can do 100, whatever you want. Um, okay, delivery me method, you can accelerate it if you want. We're gonna accelerate this one just to see what happens because on standard, it spreads it out. Well, when you do accelerated, you're gonna know more or less how much money you can spend. So, so let's say your ad budget is wasted by 12 o'clock. Well, you know you can double up your ad budget and hope it lasts longer. If standard, you really don't know that. So I, I'm gonna put accelerate it on this one. Once again, that's up to you guys. Um, you might see a significant difference. Okay, the network we're using. Okay, I don't want video partners on display network. I just want YouTube videos and YouTube search results. Um, you can even separate these out. Whenever developing campaigns, it's a good idea to separate them out, build another campaign for tracking purposes. Location, United States. Bidding maximum cost per view. Okay, so we're good there. Um, marketing high demo. Max cost per view. I'm gonna go, actually I'm gonna bid high. Now you're not gonna spend this much. I'm gonna bid 25 cents a view. You're not gonna spend this much. Um, usually it's around eight to 12 cents a view on average. Okay, and I'll show you that. And if you wanna do popular video adjustment, um, I don't, you can. Now your demographics, okay, you can change all of this stuff. You can, um, I'm just looking through what I normally like to do. Sometimes I'll turn off these unknowns because if Google doesn't know anything about them, it might be a bot, might be, there's just not a lot of information there. So I'll turn those off at times. Okay, interest, we're gonna get into this stuff after we get the video. So let's jump over here. So this is the video I'm using. This video was very easy to create. It was a matter of me just showing people what we do and how we set up a campaign. Okay, much like this one. If, if I wanted a successful video, I would take the video I'm shooting right now and turn around and create kind of an explainer video about it because what people wanna see is what you do. Don't worry about getting all cutesy or spending huge amounts of money. If your product or service is good, People wanna see what you do, and you can just make a video of it and then post it, okay? So we'll grab this one. Um, we can, you can do in-stream, okay, in-stream or pre-roll ads. So here they are, here's the website, Google Video Partners. We're not doing that, we're just gonna go on YouTube. You can see what it looks like on desktop and mobile. My final URL is just the website. Now, ideally you want a tracking code in here, so you can do a UTM tracking. Um, you can build those easily, Google it. Okay, and then we are gonna, now, once that is up, okay, I skipped the placements because I said we're gonna go back in, into it right now. So here are your options. You've got keywords, you have audiences, you have demographics, topics, or placements. Okay, we're gonna go into placements. And let me add a placement. And you could have done this before, but I just wanna show you how to add them later. Okay, we're gonna select the ad group. Now, so here are your different options. Um, whenever it comes to the placement campaign, which is one of my favorite campaigns, the placement, you have, you type in your keyword up here and it's gonna give you YouTube channels that you can run on. It's gonna give you YouTube videos and websites, 
Okay, I don't mess with apps, nor do I mess with app categories. Now, if you're in this industry, obviously you might wanna do that, but here I do not. Um, so I did some searches before, and you'll see here on the right-hand side, I have some handpick. If you wanna handpick the videos, you can jump over here and type in the exact video. I pulled this off of YouTube. So I just did a search, and if I find best content marketing videos, if I find a video that I like, and it has a little yellow mark on here on the timeline, that means it allows an ad, okay? So I'll go down through all my keywords. So I'm all about online marketing. So right here, Gary Vaynerchuk, right there, Keynote. If I want that video, I'm gonna take this. Paste the URL. Ad placement, okay? So and now it's over here. I have to find it. It's somewhere in here, okay? We'll just make sure. Okay, now, so those are your options. Um, you can also, let's say Gary I don't think I was even close. Yeah, there you go. So if he's somebody you want to target, you can target all these videos. Okay, you just click them. It'll send them over to the right-hand side. So that is how you do a uh, placement campaign. You're going to save that. And there you have it. Okay, now you want to monitor this. You want to see which videos are working, which are not, and then you can click up here and say, okay, where are my ads shown? It'll show you that after it has some tracking data. And now, some things to be aware of. Don't play on kids' videos. Don't play on music videos unless they have a huge budget. Make sure your videos that you are promoting are past 30 seconds so that people have to skip them because if they skip them, then it doesn't charge you. So that's on the placement. Now, if you can go back here and add keywords. So let's go marketing. I'm gonna select, I can create a new ad group. Ideally, I would create a new ad group. I would not do this one. Oops. So I just type in Okay, advertising online. So you can just pick all these keywords and they will show up for certain keywords. Got it? Then your other ones are audiences. I do like audiences. Here's your different options on audiences. So you can see them. You have affinity audiences. Okay. Here they, here's some options. So if you know somebody who, you have a video in the travel space then you can pick travel space. And Google's getting really good at, tr at tracking you, okay? So remarketing, I love remarketing campaigns. You can do similar audiences combined, website visitors. So that's something you should be doing. But the more you get into this platform, the more you can see there are things that are opening up. You're able to target demographics, you're able to target remarketing, placements, topics, what people are searching for in market audiences. And when I say in market, that means they're searching for your product or service. Affinity, okay, they have interest or they've shown interest in your service. Got it? So that is it. Um, I already told you some things you need to be aware of. Don't blow your budget on kids' videos. Okay, there are a few other ways you can eliminate um, certain political things, okay, Ra only run on G-rated videos, stuff like that, and that is found in this platform, okay? Um, devices, if you wanna eliminate, a lot of times I will eliminate mobile devices because I've found that my conversions are a lot higher on the um, desktop, okay? And mobile, a lot of times, when people are on mobile, they don't wanna see ads, I, they just wanna skip them. But on desktop, they're more willing to watch them, so can do ad schedule, you can do locations. I mean, there's a lot of different options here. A matter of testing, 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 and then fine tuning your campaign. Got it?
If you have questions, um, reach out to us, marketinghigh.com. Okay, we'd be happy to help. We do offer, sometimes we'll set these up for free for you. So just reach out to us and we'll help you. Talk to you later.